It's the kind of beat to go. Hey guys, as we anxiously await the drop of World's Domination 2.0, we're going to take a look back today and just kind of see where we've been, what we've been doing, just kind of taking a look back from the beginning of World's Domination and kind of like where I started, where a bunch of you started, and just kind of throwing it back to the like this version because it's going to be a completely different game once 2.0 drops. So I thought we'd kind of take a look back at what we've done, what we've seen, and pretty much where we all started is San Francisco. I mean, that's where we played the tutorial. That's where we learned how to play the game. Where we all just started. That's where we started. Right there. All had to start somewhere. We just worked our way from, from there. And now look at us. We are took down Manila. That Manila. I'm sure all of you know. We all saw Manila like third or fourth like part of the objective. And we were all obliterated. We couldn't do anything about it. And later on we just learned that we had to get, uh, what was it, Destructor to finish off Aftershock. But at first we are just kind of annoyed because... We had this crazy powerful guy just going against him. We had to figure out how to beat him. We just worked our way through the storyline, took him out, grew our crew, and of course, the machine gunner. When we all got a machine gunner, we were all so excited because we all just wrecked everything in our path. We just whooped everything because nobody could defeat us. Impossible to play. And beats, we all tried out new strategies. We all ended up getting newer and better troops. We all fell in love. With a dead shot, if you have acquired it. E Rex. We all got our first legendary. Mine was the Buzzsaw. If you haven't gotten a legendary yet, you keep working. You can get them anywhere. I got mine on Vancouver. It was crazy. Let's see, where else we got? Guild Wars. With your guild. Trying to take out Dubai and Buenos Aires. Those are the toughest things that you'll ever face on the storyline. I know that for sure. And then, pretty much, I think we should finish this little episode off. It's going to be pretty short, but I thought we should kind of look at it at Manila. Because what we all did was work our way towards that, and that's where we finished it off. Manila, the Destructor. And to, me, to be honest with you guys, I've got a lot of awesome stuff planned for when 2.0 drops. Got an awesome series lined up for you guys, and I'm going to have a really awesome schedule laid out for you. But while we're still living in the current thing... We're going to say goodbye to Destructor because he's going to be revamped and turn into Captain Zeta with a bunch of crazy upload stages. It's going to be sick. I'm really excited to see it. But until then, we pretty much just have him just chilling out here. And we're going to throw him in the middle here with machine gunners at either end just helping out, wipe out the horde. So let's start these waves and speed it up and let's see what Destructor can do. Because, of course, we all have seen Destructor many times, but, you know, I think we should see him again. Because if you haven't gotten him yet, this is going to be a great first look at for you guys because he just absolutely wrecks. My absolute favorite part, which I discovered pretty quick, was when he stim destructed, he turned into a machine gunner. Crazy, awesome, just tears through everything, and it's so cool. And I love it. It's awesome. Hmm. All right, guys. Throw it back to the Boston hat. <laughs> mm. Yeah. I love it. Look at this structure. We got some machine gunners helping out here. Um, wipe out all those drones. We have the final wave, and I think that, yep, there he is. I'm gonna be honest, I think that was the quickest takedown of Destructor Aftershock that I'm ever gonna have. Stim up, Destructor helped take him out just a little bit faster. We got two machine gunners wiping him out. Whoa, that was crazy. So long, Boston Hat. So long. But guys, that was kind of our taking a look back, just kind of enjoying what we've seen. We took a look. We took a look at the clouds. Look at that sweet little skull and crossbones. I feel like that hat. This little cloud here looks like a Mickey Mouse bunny thingy. This looks like an alligator. Um, there's more. I know there's more. The squid. There's a cat somewhere. Where's the cat? Kitty cats. I know it's somewhere. Well, guys, that's gonna conclude our little look back video. Thank you so much for watching. I know we're all looking forward to 2.0, and I will see you guys in the next episode.